morning everyone. My name is Steve and I'm the proud father of the bride. On behalf of Karen and myself, I would like to welcome everyone here today. Emily, our youngest daughter. How beautiful and radiant do you look today? Her two sisters would say, Emily was the spoiled one, <laughs> the favorite. But that's not true, is it, Em? No. <laughs> when they were growing up, Kirsty and Lucy were always teasing her, calling her Emily Jane the Pain. <laughs> but they always gave in and let her play Baby Spice in their Spice Girl productions. Yeah. Emily, you are a beautiful girl inside and out and you look like a princess today, my little angel. I'm a really proud dad. Em met the man of her dreams on New Year's Day 2018. We knew it was serious when she wanted to bring him home to meet us. Sam was not a disappointment. A kind, polite young man with good family values. Since then, it's been great getting to know Jane, Harry and the rest of the family. Jane, you've done a great job of raising two wonderful sons. think any amount of preparation can ever leave you ready to give your daughter away. But if I had to choose a person to hand her to, I'd be picking you every time. No pun intended. May today be the beginning of the most incredible journey together. Life is full of surprises and excitement, and I know you two will enjoy the ride. We wish you both every happiness. Emily and Sam, the bride and groom. I, Emily, take you, Sam. I, Emily, take you, Sam. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death us do part. Till death us do part. According to God's holy law. According to God's holy law. In the presence of God I make this vow. In the presence of God I make this vow. on behalf of my wife and I. <laughs> Thank you all for coming. As you know, weddings like this don't just happen. We've been planning this wedding for almost a year now. When I say we, I mean Emily has been doing all the hard work. <laughs> I just got really good at saying, yes, babe. <laughs> Whatever you want, babe. <laughs> But seriously, Em, but today would not have been possible without your hard work. Organisation, relentless pursuit for perfection, which actually makes all sense now why you end up with me. <laughs> me and Emily 
met by chance at an event, both my friends were DJing. There was no reason for our paths to cross, but they did. Maybe it was divine intervention. But both of us needed to make it out that night, didn't we? Because we both had hangovers, didn't we? The night before. But something told me I had to go out that day. And I didn't know that very decision would really be the most significant I'd ever make. From the first time we met on that night out, I felt like I knew from a previous life. Never had met some, someone that I had such a connection with. It also helped to use an absolute hottie. <laughs> Your laugh was infectious, your smile was endearing, your joke's nearly as bad as mine. <laughs> it wasn't love until I was in love with you. <laughs> in nearly five years of knowing you, we experienced so much together. We, vi we visited some breathtaking places, ate some of the most amazing foods. We bought our first home, welcomed our fur baby into the world. But the most, the most thing I'm grateful for is that you made me into a better person. Someone that I've always wanted to be. Someone that's compassionate, full of others, positive. Just naming a few things that rubbed off on me. Thank you for always having my back and loving me for who I am. I'm such a lucky man to be able to call you my wife and no words on this paper will ever do lo my love for you justice. I can't wait to do life and grow up with you. Sam, if I have not told you enough, I will tell you now. You are the kindest person I know. You have enough love in your heart for all your family, friends, and Emily, who is now your wife. A mother's love for her child is unique. It is special. I wanted Sam to have everything in life. I wanted him to always be surrounded by those who loved him. And one day, I hoped that he would find someone to love and who would love him just as much. And that is why I'm so happy that he met Emily. Not only is she beautiful inside and out, she's kind, caring, and brings out the best in Sam. She makes him happy. Thank you, Emily, for making our family happier. For that, I will be eternally grateful. Now my wish is for you to both be willing to move the sun and the moon for each other. And may your marriage be as blessed as we are, having you both in our lives. Here's to having a lifetime of dancing on tables. I love you both. <laughs> <laughs>